RSV is a common virus that can affect anyone, but symptoms can be especially severe in babies. I'm gonna show you some examples of breathing signs to look out for and when to seek medical care. RSV, or respiratory syncytial virus, peaks in the colder months, from fall to early spring. For most kids, RSV causes mild cold-like symptoms, like runny nose, cough, and fever. However, if it spreads into the lungs, it can cause bronchiolitis or pneumonia, which can get severe, especially in babies. Here are some signs to look out for. Number one, fast breathing. Normal breathing in babies is 30 to 60 breaths per minute. If your baby is breathing at 60 breaths per minute or more persistently for 10 to 15 minutes, that is considered fast breathing. Number two, difficulty breathing. This means that babies are using muscles that they don't normally use to help them breathe. You might see the belly coming in and out with every breath. These are called subcostal retractions. Next, check if you can see the ribs more prominently with breathing, known as intercostal retractions. Then, you might see the neck sucking inwards or the side of the neck muscles flexing. These are called suprasternal retractions. Other signs of difficulty breathing are nasal flaring or the head bobbing up and down with every breath. Finally, difficulty breathing can also be seen when babies are grunting with every breath out. They do this to try to keep the tiny air sacs of the lungs open. Number three, cyanosis. This is when the skin or the lips turn blue, pale, or gray in color. This is a sign that their oxygen level is dropping. Number four, decreasing wet diapers. When babies are using all their energy to breathe, they may not feed as well and they may have a hard time staying hydrated. So if your baby is not making a wet diaper at least every six to eight hours, that tells us they are starting to get dehydrated. If you notice any of these signs, you should seek medical care right away.